So both type 1 and type 2 diabetes um, have their own challenges. Uh, type 1 diabetes is the most common kind of diabetes in pediatric patients affecting uh, probably around 90% um, or more of pediatric patients with diabetes. Type 1 diabetes results from the uh, body's autoimmune destruction of the insulin producing beta cells. A child diagnosed with uh, type 1 diabetes is dependent upon insulin given by injection or by pump uh, for the duration of his or her life with the requirement to also attend extraordinarily carefully to diet and exercise with the aid of blood glucose monitoring by finger stick or uh, continuous glucose monitoring technologies. The treatment for type 1 diabetes is in an extraordinary era of uh, remarkable advances. There are, have been a, a, a number of a great new um, insulin analogs over the last um, uh, 15 to 20 years now and even new, newer insulins that are on the horizon. Um, in addition, there are advanced insulin delivery systems, um, obviously great insulin pens, um, as well as um, very uh, compact insulin pumps with bolus calculators that will help the pediatric patient and family as well as adults with type 1 diabetes to dose insulin. Of course, there have been uh, great advances in blood glucose monitoring technology as well as in the continuous glucose monitoring technology. And finally, there is the marriage of the insulin pump with the continuous glucose monitor, which will result in um, automation of insulin delivery, often referred to as closed loop therapy or as the artificial pancreas. And there are um, extraordinary um, advances with the uh, newer and newer iterations of automated insulin delivery. Um, these are undergoing many clinical studies. We are in an era where there are so many advances in medicine in general and in diabetes in particular. To remain up to date with the newest opportunities for medications as well as device implementation, it is likely uh, in the hands of the specialist. It would be the pediatric endocrinologist, the pediatric diabetes specialist, the multidisciplinary diabetes team who is probably best equipped to help the pediatric patient with diabetes and the family members. Pediatricians are a very fundamental part of the, of the healthcare team or the healthcare village that is caring for the child and the family unit. Uh, the child with diabetes can get the diabetes care from the uh, pediatric specialist in endocrinology diabetes. The pediatrician um, is so fundamental to the overall child and family health because the child still needs routine physicals, immunizations, um, and uh, help with the management of uh, acute conditions such as a, a flu or earache that may arise. And it's probably best for the pediatrician to be managing those in concert with the pediatric endocrinologist who may assist the family with sick day management. During any intercurrent illness, um, it is likely that the blood sugars go um, out of target and there may need to be insulin adjustments and probably that is the concerted effort of the pediatrician as well as the diabetes team who manage, who help to manage that pediatric patient.